What's going on everyone? There was CK1, then CKB, then CK2, and now CK All. Let's see if this one here is an all-pleasing scent. It's coming up right now. CK All was launched around summertime, just around July, August of last year of 2017. Not much really talked about. I wonder why. Sizes for this one, you're looking at 50 ml like this one, 100 ml or 200 ml, and you can find this already at discount websites. I'm gonna leave down the link below where I got mine so you can get yours. The concentration for this one is Eau de Toilette EDT, and two amazing perfumers were summoned to put this one together, Harry Fremont and Alberto Morillas, which happens to be the actual perfumers of the original CK1. What do I get from CK All? Glad you asked. So this one here is pretty much a combination of citruses, especially the mandarin up top, with a beautiful, lovely, creamy rhubarb note that you're gonna get in the heart with some mixed florals. The dry down, it's gonna be a floral, creamy, sweet, light, vetiver, musky kind of a dry down, which is quite nice. If you ask me, it's a combination of CK1, CKB, combined with some floral notes, the rhubarb, that make CK All a scent that it is. Yes, absolutely. CK All is one of those, uh, not aquatic scents, but citrus floral aromatics that are very easy to wear, easy to please, grab and go, spray, you don't have to think too much, you know you're gonna smell pleasant, you know you're gonna smell good, you know you're gonna garner positive attention with this one. This is perfect for spring and summer up ahead. This is gonna be one of those casual kind of scents for me, one of those that I can wear for, you know, going casually groceries or just to a barbecue outside. Great for outdoors, it has components in here, like I said, the floral, the citrus, the, the musk vetiver uh, character that you get with this scent, it's very nice and conducive of the outdoors. So definitely one that I'm gonna be rocking out for barbecues, casual wear, and going out and about this uh, spring and summertime. This is definitely an androgynous scent. This is a fragrance that anyone can wear with any age group. I don't see a problem with this one whatsoever. It's very easy to please, grab and go, spray and be happy kind of scent. Invigorating, sparkling, bright, citrus aromatic scent. One of the best from the house of late. What I do love about this scent, like I mentioned before, it encapsulates CKB, CK1 into this fragrance, adding some really interesting floral notes, a little nice creamy rhubarb that's a little bit sweet and, and very captivating with some light vetiver musky dry down that's sweet, floral, citrus, aromatic, and extremely pleasant. Performance here, as with all CK fragrances of late, you're not gonna be looking at beast mode projection or, or longevity. I got about four hours with this. Arm's length, a beautiful one hour good push. Then it set close to my skin. People got whiffs if they were close to me. I've been wearing this for about three weeks now. Again, not beastly performing, but quite good for a citrus aromatic. So final thoughts on CK All. I haven't really seen a great, you know, trendsetter, groundbreaking fragrance from CK in quite a while. You know, some of my greatest favorite ones were Calvin, the self-titled one, Eternity for Man, Escape, CK1, CKB, Obsession, just to name a few. You know, CK Shock was one of the best ones over the past few years. I keep my eyes open for CK so that hopefully they'll put out a new trendsetter and groundbreaking fragrance just like the ones I mentioned above. With that said, that concludes the review of CK All. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think are the best releases from CK and Calvin Klein. What are your top three favorites of all time? And also, if you have gotten your noses on CK All, please comment down below. At this time, I'd like to please, if I may, ask you to continue to support the channel by liking, sharing, and subscribing for a lot of more great content like this one. And of course, enable notifications so you guys always get first dibs on new releases, fragrant news, and reviews just like this one. And as always, keep on spraying, and of course, I got you covered. See you next time.